Hi Libra, welcome to your mid to late September reading. Thanks for joining me. My name is Michelle. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. Libra, mid to late September going into October. Pixie, the energy around you is very original. It feels to me like you're being urged to be the real you. So there's a childlike energy that I'm sensing around this. There may be something that you're wanting to do that feels, uh, it feels like something, well, maybe something that you gave up younger when you were, in, when you were younger. Yeah, it feels like something creative. It, it, I get a, a lot of creative energy around you here, Libra. It may be that there's something that you've wanted to always do. Maybe it's an energy here of uh, showing a unique part of yourself. I, I get kind of like, uh, for some of you here, making your own clothes or uh, some, something about the way that you present yourself is changing. And it, it's coming out in terms of the real you rather than a you that has been put on you by others. Others, yeah, put on you by others, basically. Around you, though, we have this coercion. So, yeah, I see that as coercing you to be a certain way. No, I mean, my goodness. There's an energy around you of protecting, with Night Ride here. I get protecting who you are, protecting that younger you, protecting that, uh, that self that wants to come out, not being coerced or blackmailed into being a certain way or doing something here uh, that goes against who you truly are. Libra, interesting energy. Could be you, could be someone around you. Uh, if you're cross-watching, could be a Libra that you're dealing with as well. Bottom of the deck, magician, beautiful energy for you. Two of cups in reverse. I feel that that's, that's the other energy. It could be a, a either a love partner or potential love partner. I actually feel like it's more about a potential love partner. You're showing up here as the Queen of Cups, Libra. So I do feel that when it comes to your unique expression of love, I don't feel you need to change. Love is in reverse. I get some incompatibilities. There's someone around you who is, uh, you're finding incompatible. They seem to want to make you into something. They want to make you into someone that you're not. And you know what? You don't have to stand for that. You, you don't have to, you don't have to take on this person's burdens as your own. It seems like it's all, it's all about them and what they want out of you without them really paying attention to who you are as an individual. Libra. Goodness. Okay, let's see. I'm going to cut these cards. We'll start with the signifier for you where you currently stand with this, where well, you hope to stand with it in the future, how you're viewing this person, how you've perceived them in the past, your doubts and fears about this, what's happening in your environment that's affecting the situation and the potential outcome, and the other person. I've got the Ten of Pentacles in reverse at the bottom of the deck. You know, I feel like there's something there, there there's some kind of uh, change that's going on in their life. Now, either side can resonate, so please do keep that in mind. I do feel that they're coming in like directly from something else is what I'm getting from spirit with a lot of uh, a lot of force. You know, there's that coercion energy that I'm picking up here. Uh, it's fiery energy, it's passionate energy. But at the same time, it feels like it's, uh, again, it's not being truthful. I get that this individual is, is wanting to somehow control the situation or control the situation with you. Let's get a signifier for them, where they currently stand, where they hope to stand with this in the future, how they're viewing you, Libra, how they've perceived you in the past, their doubts and fears about this, what's happening in their environment and the potential outcome. Okay, so this person kind of wants to be, they want to be your protector. You know, I see this, uh, they want to be this strong person, but you know what, you're, you're, I don't feel that you need uh, protecting. 
let's have a look. I've got your energy here as the star. For them, I've got the world. Yeah. I do feel that the star energy around you is unique. You seem to be shining at the moment. You seem to be coming into your own uh, powers, Libra. I get you as someone who is uh, potentially potentially a star in your field. Whatever you are choosing to do here, I get create creativity, something that you're creating. Now, you could be creating a business. But for others of you, it's more about something that you're actually bringing into the world, uh, it feels unique, it feels like a unique expression of some kind. It could even be like the written word or uh, something that you're making. Now the other person with the world card, I do feel that they're completing out a cycle in their life. Where you stand right now, you've got the strength card, but it's in the reverse. So there is a, a sense of... Uh, I get temptation. This person seems to be a temptation. Very tempting. Then I've got the Hermit Libra. So I feel like they're alone at the present time. They have recently finished something out in their life. They've completed something. Uh, you know what? I feel like this person's older. They may be someone here who is finishing finishing up their working life, uh, retiring, uh, they don't want to be, they don't want to be alone, uh, goodness, yeah, th it's tempting though, I feel Libra, there's some kind of tempting energy around this, but I feel like you're, you've recently come into your own here, well you hope to stand with this in the future, the Ten of Cups in reverse, yeah, I don't feel that you want to, uh, uh, you don't want to settle down with this person. It feels like this person's ready to settle down. Uh, they, don't, they don't want to be alone. Where they hope to stand with this in the future, we've got the Three of Swords. Goodness. You know what? I'm going to get a clarifier on that right now. Why would they have the Three of Swords here as their hope? Okay, Page of Pentacles. Makes sense. They seem to have suffered a great deal of, uh... okay, I feel like Libra, this is someone, I feel like this is someone that you've known. I don't want to say it's an ex just yet, but I am getting that there it has been previous energy flowing between the two of you. Now, in this case, this person has suffered pain as a result of that. So you may have left them or you may have uh, uh, rejected them in the past, Libra. But with the Page of Pentacles, this person is wanting to start again. They're wanting a clean slate. Let's try. That's what they're saying. Now, let's have a look and see how you are viewing them, the Nine of Pentacles. And let's see how they're viewing you. The Eight of Cups. Okay. You're viewing them. There's this strong independent kind of energy that I'm picking up here. Yeah, I feel like they want to... I do get this kind of energy here of that they, they want to they want to have a new beginning they want to have a new beginning with you I, I get a strong energy around you though of someone who is uh, really just wanting to remain a uh, single uh, you're not looking for commitment you have this uh, strong energy of you know what I, I like where I'm at I like what I'm doing I'm, I'm good but there's this kind of temptation here as well they kind of lure, it's like a lure. I feel like they're luring you away with some kind of tempting offer. What could that be? Now let's see. How you have perceived them in the past, the Knight of Pentacles. So they've been around you, uh, trying their best. I feel like they've been really trying their best to, to get you to do something. You know, coercion, right? It feels like it was smaller energy in the past. 
but for some reason I'm getting an energy around them of that is ramping up here mid to late September they may be becoming more uh, more forceful than that Knight of Pentacles that's past energy that feels like slower movement it feels more timid how they've perceived you in the past the Nine of Wands and Rest yeah they have been hurt by you in the past I feel it's kind of like they've they've gotten close to you. You you they may have been burned a little by this energy of the star, right? Stars are hot, and, and I get that kind of energy around you, uh, Libra. It feels like this person has been overwhelmed, maybe even a little bit intimidated by you in the past. Yeah. Let's see, your doubts and fears, the Four of Swords, their doubts and fears, the Nine of Cups. Wow, you are this person's wish fulfillment, Libra. For you, as your doubts and fears about this, well, the thing is, you're really wanting to take some time here to think things through. It seems like this person has come to you with some kind of... Uh, offer I feel like it's a, it's an offer of a, a stable relationship um, yeah I feel that you're really not wanting to rush this I, I get you wanting to take some time to think this through this person is, is really wanting this to happen I mean that that's they're really hoping that this comes to fruition Your external influence, the Nine of Swords in reverse. Yeah, this person, I do feel that they're trying to overcome some uh, anxieties in their life, some fears. I get some inadequacies or insecurities around this person. Their external influence is the Moon in reverse. It's conquering those doubts and fears, conquering those anxieties, uh, being able to uh, to work through something. I feel like this person has a lot of fear associated with being alone. Uh, they seem to be, I have to be honest, I am picking up like a codependent energy around this person, I mean, coercion. They really seem to be focused on they don't just want to date you. I mean, they want to immediately get into like a relationship and like... Uh, let's move in together let's get married that kind of energy which is a little bit much for you uh, Libra to be honest mm, let's have a look and see the outcome yeah two of swords in reverse it's it's I feel like they're giving you an ultimatum and they're kind of forcing you to make some kind of choice but it's uh, it's stressing you out it's making you anxious you're thinking oh gosh you know and their outcome is the Five of Swords in, rever in reverse. I do feel that they uh, were really trying everything that they could. I get uh, every kind of emotional manipulation in the book, really, with that Five of Swords. But I don't feel it's worked. I, I feel like you're wise to it. I feel like you have looked at this. You've thought things through. Uh, you've, uh, you haven't reacted. You have uh, paid careful attention to this person's words and actions and I feel like you're making a decision that is based on what you see and what you've heard spirit guides are saying also you're making a decision based on the level of uh, stress that this or anxiety that this person causes to you it's kind of like paying attention to your your how your body reacts or responds when you're around this particular person I feel like they stress you out they make you nervous <clears throat> they make you nervous Libra because it seems like they're trying to force something you know and, and to you I get that it, it makes you a little bit it puts your nerves on edge yeah it puts your nerves on edge and, and I feel like this this individual is, is just needing to, to walk away from this because they're not able to get their way before I go to the extended guys let's get a fairy blessing card if this is your reading Libra please do join me in the extended reading the link is below in the descriptions box 
it'll be about another 30 minute reading much more in depth so please do join me if this one is resonating if you would prefer a personal reading you can email me gypsyinsights at gmail.com and don't forget to like share and subscribe if you're a newcomer love to have you i'm also offering channel memberships those are brand new you can become a member uh, yes and subscribe to my band of gypsies and uh, with that you'll get uh, on, on the uh, higher level you'll get an access to the videos early as well as get them all at once so no waiting so please do check those out let's get a fairy blessing card for you libra a blessing of amid okay let's see what that one is about libra working with okay this this is a very natural kind of energy insightful ability how are you okay it's health health it's coming from a place of health and grounded energy stability i'm feeling very strong plant-based or tree-based energy around this yeah it feels like uh, getting out mm, needing to i feel like that there's an energy here of you, you may have been tempted to be get involved with this person because you were missing being out and about is what i'm getting from spirit some of you may have spent a little bit too much time indoors all right and i get you as someone here who's a, i get it like a page of cups energy around that someone who's quite playful very youthful kind of energy and this person saying you yeah, come and play with me but behind that maybe innocent offer with that knight of pentacles is uh, some emotional energy of, of man either manipulation or like a uh, a darker kind of energy of them wanting to i get it's coming under the guise of protection but i actually feel it's more about you would be doing something for them by going towards them meaning that you would be providing them with okay an energy of uh, releasing them from this fear of being alone spirit guide is saying but at the expense of your individuality and I feel that's that's where this choice comes in so they do seem to be giving you some kind of choice here yeah it's being with someone who would be uh, somewhat I, I do get very strong codependent kind of energy around this person or remaining in, in this individual energy it's tempting you are tempted by this but you're being urged to, to think about it and also pay attention to how your body feels and reacts responds when you're around this person are they making you tense are they making you nervous or are you relaxed at peace i feel that's going to be the indicator of which choice you should make but libra let's look take a look at this in the extended if this one's resonating again please do join me the link is down below in the descriptions box if uh, and again if you prefer a personal reading my email is on the screen gypsyinsights at gmail.com wishing you the best libra uh, please take care thank you very much for watching and uh, bye for now